Trip Phoenix for race number three. Getting ready for the Xfinity race. This is actually the first Xfinity race of the season. So, let's get racing. Also, I think uh, my arm broke off. My, my, my... My arm, my arm, my arm, it hurts, <laughs> my arm, oh wait, oh shoot, um, okay, so nothing happened there, but green flag, everything, the blue stuff just suddenly disappeared, I wonder how that happened, hmm, AJ Omening are in the lead. Oh, the 92 making a big move and gets squeezed. AJ Omening leads lap one, now lap two. There's uh, 30 laps. AJ Omening are still in the lead. Hamrick in the back making some moves here. Oh, here we go again. On the back straight away. Actually, the front straight away. They save it, though. No wrecks. So we're going to stay green as we're coming to lap number four at Phoenix. We may have a lead change here. Michael Annette is battling. He does take it. Oh, he got a spinner. 78. It is a single car spin though, but he's not going. No caution though. We want to have a great race. No, Gregson making a move. He's trying to be side by side with Michael Annette. And it looks like Noah Gregson may lead this lap. He surely does. So now that we have a new leader, let's see. Oh, we got another one trying to take the lead away from Gregson. They're not the only ones battling for a lead. Are these guys heading to pit road? Yes, they are. They're going to have to pit road to get some pit stops there. No, Gregson still leads as we're coming to lap number seven of the stage. So, no, Gregson so far is leading. Now to lap number seven. Coming to lap eight next time by. The one car still needs to get that run. Oh, the five car going up the racetrack. Went up the racetrack. He's going to lose some positions. On to lap eight. Three laps to go in stage one. So far, there's been no cautions. So, we're having a good race so far. The nine's going to lead lap. Number eight, two laps to go in stage number one. We're going to come to the final lap of the stage. Wait, fly one more time around for the stage one. Noah Gregson so far is in the lead. Oh, we're going to have a big crash and the caution is going to come out. Oh, no, the leaders just crashed. Big, big crash. Who's going to win the stage? The caution is out. The 44 Tommy Joe Martins win stage one. And the leaders is wrecked out in a hard crash. What in the world? No, Gregson, hard into the wall. The one of Michael Nett. 
was just a few positions back. He was right behind Noah Gregson. The caution is going to come out after a wild stage finish. Just now we got our more people coming off pit road. What a finish in stage one after Noah Gregson, Michael Annette, Crash, and more. That was wild. How in the world did that happen? Is my arm short? My arm. Oh, jeez. Anyways. Tommy Joe Martins wins his first stage win in this series after a big wreck happening. Collecting multiple cars. And uh, seven cars. Out of seven cars in that wreck, two of them are out. That's Michael Annette and Noah Gregson. Gregson hit the wall really hard. I think the one car is on his side, yeah. The one car is on his side. What a big crash at Phoenix. Man, I can't believe what just happened there. That that was just that was wild. Wow, coming back green as we're going to get some crank it ups. Getting ready. So, you want to hear some crank it ups from, from these race car drivers? You're going to get them in just a few laps. So, now on to stage two because of that huge crash. We would go have a restart, but nope. Green flag for stage number two. On the backstretch, Tommy Joe Marts are three wide, a few rows back, and it's great racing as they do not crash on the back straight away. No, the front straight straight away, but Austin Tindrick's trying to take the lead. Whoa, we got some cars having trouble in the back. Landon Castle. Landon Castle was a lot of trouble. That was on the front straightaway. Landon Castle and others nearly wrecking. Tommy Joe Martin still leads. He's trying to get his first career win. No crashes on the front stretch so far. There's about to be a crash coming to the start finish line. Tommy Joe Martins still leads. Can he keep it though? So far everybody's being calm about racing on this front stretch. In the cup series, there's a lot of crashes on that front stretch. Still, oh, some cars, some cars are, oh, Austin Sindrick, Justin Allgaier, Justin Haley, and Austin Sindrick is the only car in that accident that pitted. They went off the racetrack making contact. Tommy Joe Martins, still in the lead, but he gets passed by Matt Mills. The six, Ryan Vargas coming into the picture. Oh, we got a big stack up there. One car was, oh man, a lot of smoke coming from some of these cars after making that huge contact. On to the back straightaway now. Lap seven of ten in the stage. Matt Mills still leads with the zero right behind him. We're going to have to crank it up in uh, stage three. These people are racing hard. 
Here comes Tommy Joe Martins. Here comes the 16 of AJ Allmendinger. And he goes off the racetrack. He was just in the lead, coming to lap number nine of the stage here. Justin Oliver was leading, actually, uh, AJ Allmendinger, and he goes off the racetrack. Tommy Joe Martin takes the lead away. Daniel Hemrick making moves, and we got a crash. The 74, the 8, crash. We're not going to have a caution since we're coming to the final stage. Actually, to the last lap of the stage. White flag for stage number 2. A lot of guys are racing hard. Here we come to the stripe. Who's going to win the stage? It's going to be this... I think the four, Landon Castle, is going to win the stage. That was wild. David Starr was involved in that accident. Man, wild, wild finish in these stage. Wild finishes in these. Like, it's, it, 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 it's just the way we're racing. They finish very... Very unpredictable. It's very unpredictable of who's going to win this race and advance to the round of 16. Because we only have uh, 10 races here in this season for all of the series. We usually don't. We would have a bit past that 14 races. But, hey, I mean, since we have Martinsville coming up, not exactly Martinsville after this track, but Talladega. We're going to get some exciting racing at that racetrack. Then you're just going to have, um, then you're going to have Martinsville. You have Rich Richmond. And then you're going to go to Dover. And then for the final race, of course, it's going to be Texas. The race before Texas, it's going to be the Coke Zero Sugar 400. So, yeah. As well, don't forget the Daytona Road Course right before uh, the Coke the Geo Sugar 400. Green flag, once again. With stage three. Some cars got a very bad, bad restart there. I'm surprised. Whoa. Okay, I thought we had a crash over here already. Tommy Joe Martins in the lead. They're going to make it four, five wide here. Why am I hearing no? Uh, somebody saying no. Like, I'm hearing somebody say no. I'm being serious. Tommy Joe Martins still leads. Here comes the 39 Ryan C trying to take it. It's a battle that are all battling for this lead. Here comes the zero. It's a battle there. Um, we're coming to lap. Oh, we have a huge wreck. That's Jade. I think it's Jade Buford. Big, big wreck. Oh my gosh. That's the biggest wreck yet. And I mean the hardest one too. Oh my gosh. Jade Buford. Big hit. It looks like we're going to have a restart with five to go. So we're lap number... Lap number 24... Once we hit lap 25, it's going to be 4 to go. Lap 26, 3 to go. Lap 27, 2 to go. Wait, no. Lap 29, 2 to go. So, yeah. So, we are going to have a restart. Okay. This is the battle 
where they're gonna get crazy on these restarts. So, if you guys want to sign up for the Xfinity series, just tell me what number you want, or just friend me on Roblox. Uh, for some reason, I just put that. That that that's my username. It's probably stupid though. But that's my username. If you want to friend me, you can. And just tell me the number you want, and we can do some races and stuff. I don't know. I wish I had a Discord, so, like, multiple people could be commentating. Green flag in the air once again. So we have seven laps to go, and some cars are, some people are really racing hard here. Oh, we got the 90, and Dexter being hard into the wall. Harrison Burton crashing, so is the six, Ryan Vargas. Oh, we got another car crashing. That's AJ Allmendinger, I'm pretty sure. The zero is round. We got a big wreck here. Daniel Hemrick's involved. Ryan Vargas, Dexter Bean with the big hit. We're going to have another caution. Wow. So now we're going to restart with four laps to go. Looks like we're going to be a lap number 27, I think. So, a lot of cars. So the cars that are not with the pack, those are the cars involved. And the cars that are also, like, the new cars out the racetrack, they are also involved. Big, big crash here at Phoenix. Taking out multiple cars. Dexter Bean. Big hit. I think his car is upside down here. No, it's not, but this is Dexter Bean here. Or 06, but I think it's the 90, which would be Dexter Bean. Yeah. Big, big hit for Dexter Bean. Ryan Vargas involved. Daniel Hemrick. At least get some cars back on. There you go. AJ Ominger. He lost the lead. Before in like stage number two or stage one, and he didn't win that stage to get those playoff points. And now he's wrecked out here at Phoenix with only a few laps to go. What a restart this could be! This could be for all the ages. The question is who's the winner? What the heck does... Okay, it looks like those cards jumped out. What the heck? Okay. Apparently something happened. Um, that's weird, but... Gonna have a restart after a big, big wreck. So now, we may have to, okay, there they are. Dexter Bean, huge hit into the wall. They were getting really crazy. They were like three, four wide in that turn. And it was too much contact. That wreck started from, from off of turn four all the way onto the front straightaway, which is all the way over there. And then you have turn one that was coming up. I think we also had a car crash in turn one. Who was that? Somebody crashed in turn one. You see, we have an extra car over here. Somebody crashed really hard. I think it was the 15 and the 0 that crashed here. I think so. 
wild, wild race at Phoenix here. And then DC Jade Buford, huge hit, man. That was huge. He went flying up in the air. But we're going to go to an overtime restart because of that crash. Green flag, we're overtime at Phoenix. Who's going to win it? Let's say they're doing pace laps because I can't exactly catch them. So now we're going to come to the restart here. Green flag for the restart. Whoa, we got some cars really crazy on that restart. Here comes Cendric. Just an oligar making moves. He's up to third. Do they have a caution? I thought somebody crashed. Uh um Okay. Is that somebody what the heck? Yeah, somebody probably crashed. I don't what is going on over here? Why is this thing still open? Okay, so looks like we have another research. I thought somebody crashed. Cause they're all going wild. And I thought somebody went up, up onto the apron and crashed. I feel like those numbers are switched somehow. On, on the sides, in the front and the back, it says oh, 06. But on the top, it says the 90. So, I'm assuming it's Dexter Bean, since it looks like that was his paint scheme from uh, Phoenix that was earlier this year. So, now it looks like we're going to have another restart. Cindric was there. Green flag for a second overtime restart of Phoenix. Well, not yet, not yet. We got to get... We gotta get the pace stops going because I can't catch them in the racing action. So, yeah. Cindric is gonna be the leading on this restart. Green flag for the restart at Phoenix. Cindric in the lead. Here comes the pack coming up. They're all racing big. Oh, we got a crash. That's a 10 of Ross Hassane hard into the wall. And Cindric, the leader, crashes. Austin Tinder was just leading. The five of Matt Mills crashes. So does the ten. The ten was hard into the wall. And that's Kyle Weatherman as well involved. Another restart is going to happen. Another restart here at Phoenix after a big wreck again. We're going to come to our third overtime restart. Man, these guys, they're racing crazy on these restarts, but really since he got the cup, the, the Cheeto Sim Series racing here, after this, I mean, it's going to be, it's going to be wild to see who wins this, because we have another restart coming up. Look how short this pack is becoming. Look at all these cars crash on the front stretch into turn one. Yeah, that's how many cars can crash on that stretch. And we do see some pit road crashes sometimes. We see crashes that are like Jade, Jade Buford's. That was a big hit when you think about it. A really big hit. We're going to come to the restart. Sadly, we did not have time to crank it up, which sucked. So, coming back to the green flag, we're going to do a pace lap before we're going to go back green, so.
Peace out to the way. I'm gonna see who's gonna win this race and advance to the playoffs. The people who finish top 16 are gonna be in the playoffs, but mostly the the person who wins this race is gonna be locked in. Green flag. 19 on Brandon Jones, Riley Herps, all these guys making moves. Dang it. Oh, huge! Huge! Oh my goodness! I just saw cars flying! Oh my gosh! Huge wreck! The 17 you see has crashed! Another one! Who was just the 99? Other cars went flying out of the map! Huge wreck! Oh my gosh! That. Big wreck here at Phoenix. What in the world just happened? We just had cars flying out of the map. I see another one that's crashed over here. That flew. That was Riley Herbst. He was one of the cars that just flew. My goodness. That was... That was... That was huge, man. I hope all of the drivers are okay because that's a crash can, that can get you really hurt, so. Let's look at your people. Daniel Hemrick, 07. 36, Alex Obey. The... 61 of uh, David Starr, the 51 of Jeremy Clements there, Ryan Segan, the 39, Justin Haley, Mike Snyder here, Landon Castle. But that was huge. I don't even know where all of the other cars went. They just, they're gone. Just gone. They could be around the fence anywhere. But I don't see any cars that are by the fence. Man, half of the... Nearly the whole entire field is gone. Look at how much cars there is left. It's like Talladega. We're not even at Talladega yet. Green flag for our fourth overtime. We're not yet. Pace lap. Jeez. I keep forgetting about the pace lap that they have to do since I cannot... I can't see the full racing without me lagging, so. Alright, green flag. For fourth overtime. And it looks like they may make it. Unless somebody slams into the wall. White flag, one more... Mm. Now nah, two more laps. Oh my gosh. Alright, coming to the white flag here. Finally. White flag one more time around. See that 92 as they're wrecking again. There they go. Off the track. Is that all of them? Nearly... Who's gonna win it? Who's gonna win it? The caution may not come out, but will it? I don't think so. I think the 92 may have just won this. Okay, so all of the guys you see that are in this back, every single one of them have advanced to the playoffs. I think we had a big wreck here. Yeah, the 99 here. Multiple drivers went off the racetrack. So, the 26 won. Wow, what a finish after four overtime restarts. Four. It's like Talladega. You, you get a lot of overtime restarts here. And you see lots of big crashes at Talladega. This is basically... Phoenix Super Speedway. 
I mean, we have tons of big crashes here. Every time we go here, oh yeah, you see, um, what looks like to be Ty Gibbs is out after that crash. This is basically Phoenix, Phoenix Super Speedway. I mean, these guys are really crashing a lot. Man, how about the leaders crash, though? Like, the 9 no Brexit and the 1. They basically just crashed. But, crazy race at Phoenix. As you see, my arm is broken somehow. I think you need to get a new one. Ugh. But anyway, so, uh, thank you guys for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. And I will see you guys in, um... Uh, a billion, kazillion, million, I don't know, million years? Okay, bye.